Lopez and I'm originally from Portland, Oregon, but I live now in Kennewick, Washington. And I heard about Hungry Generation from a friend. She was going through some hard times and she decided to come and she loved it and she invited me. And at first I would keep saying no, I'm not ready, I'll go when I'm ready. But um, one day I decided to come and it was probably one of the best experiences I've had. At, the church, at this church. So I was raised Catholic. Um, I would go to church mostly every Sunday in a Mexican community, and it was in Spanish, so I really didn't pay attention to that church. And after a while, um, I'd stopped going to church. I, was al I always believed in, in God, but I didn't go to church. So before I got saved, um, I think I was going to church for about a month and I, I didn't um, give my life to Christ. I was really shy. I didn't want to go on stage. And I had a talk with one of my mentors and she really, because I told her that I would always get this burning sensation in my heart that every time I'd come to church, every time we would um, have service and then I, t I asked her what it was and she's like, that's the fire from God, you know, so you can give your life to Jesus Christ. And that next Wednesday is when I raised my hand and I gave my life to Jesus Christ. And I wish I would have done it sooner because the biggest difference since giving my life to Jesus Christ is I'm just more positive. I was always a happy person, but I would always think negative, like about myself, about my life, where's my life going. But now I think positive. I'm like, okay, I'm in a rough patch right now, but there's, I can get out of this. I just ask for help. I asked God for help me get me through this. I'm getting baptized. I was really, it took me a long time to get baptized because I don't know, I wanted to be ready. I wanted it to be my decision, not someone else's decision. Um, a message really spoke to me about two weeks ago when Pastor Vlad was talking about how there was three stages. There's the baby, the youth, and the father. And I thought, okay, I am definitely in the baby stage, but after that message, I'm like, I'm ready for the next step, which is the you stage. I'm ready to take that next leap so I can tell other people to come and be a better role model. I know we're going to ask you a question, a few questions. Do you believe in Jesus Christ as God's Son and your personal Lord and Savior? Yes. Do you promise to follow Him with good and clear conscience all the days of your life? Yes. Now, based on your faith, confession, and your commitment, we will baptize you in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Chains are broken, cause you spoken. It is finished at the cross. Now I'm living.